Hi, I'm Kier and I'm a product manager here at Zero Key. And in this video, I'm here to show you how to set up the Quantum RTLS Pilot Kit. This is the world's most accurate indoor positioning system. And once you're familiar with the steps involved, you can get this set up and calibrated in a matter of minutes in any environment. Let's get started. Begin by removing six anchors, two mobiles, and the gateway from your pilot kit. If taken apart for transport, thread the removable antenna to the connector on the gateway. The anchor and mobile nodes have an identical external form factor. They have a power button on the side, a micro USB port for charging, and an LED status indicator light. The circle on the front here is our ultrasonic transducer, the center of which is where our measurements are taken from. The pilot kit includes several mounting accessories for the anchors, but they can also be secured with double-sided tape on the back of the casing. In this video, we will be mounting the anchors to tripods for demonstration purposes. However, they can be mounted directly to walls or placed on available structures. Turn the anchors on by pressing the button once. The LED will turn red during boot up and will then flash green when the node is on. Just a note here that we try to keep our anchors away from corners. This could cause interference with our ultrasonic ranging and we don't want to degrade performance. So we try to just keep them a little bit away from the corner. Using the provided USB-C cable, connect the gateway to your computer with the Zero Key Config tool open. The gateway will automatically be detected, at which point you can click Connect to continue setup. Next, click Start Discovery to search for available hardware. With Discovery mode running, the anchor nodes are automatically connected. Turning on the mobile nodes with one press of the button will allow them to also be detected. Once connections to six anchors and two mobiles are shown correctly in the device log, click Stop Discovery. To calibrate the system, exactly one mobile node is required. Turn off one of your mobiles with a long hold of the button until the indicator light cycles red and turns off. Now, click Anchor Calibration and launch the interactive Zero Key Calibration Wizard. Place the anchors around the circumference of the area you want to position. For best results, point the anchors towards the center of the area and vary their height slightly. If possible, configure the anchors in a hexagon shape. With anchors deployed, you're ready to continue to step two. Step two automatically begins node discovery. Make sure exactly six anchors and one mobile are found. This can take up to one minute as nodes may have entered a sleep mode. With all nodes discovered, you're ready to continue calibration. Place the mobile on the ground in the center of the anchors with clear line of sight from the mobile to all anchors. Click start and walk around the space slowly with the mobile held at arm's length away from your body. As you move, the anchor nodes will collect measurements from the mobile. If you're doing a demo in a conference room and you decided to deploy your anchors low to the ground, it's better to hold your mobile higher up and facing the anchors, so pointed downwards during the data collection phase. On-screen progress indicates when each anchor node has obtained enough data to move on to the next step. Once all anchor nodes have collected 100% of their necessary measurements, an alarm will chime. Place the mobile back in the center of the anchors and continue to step four. The final processing involves communication between all the anchor nodes. So while this takes place, ensure the area is kept clear of people or moving objects. This step can take several minutes. Congratulations, your pilot kit is now calibrated and ready to use. You can optionally perform a scale check to validate accuracy of the calibration. Scale check requires two mobile nodes. Once the second mobile node is detected, the calculated distance between the two mobiles will be displayed on screen. Using a measuring tape, place the mobiles exactly one meter apart, measured from the center of the ultrasonic transducer. Once the nodes are placed, click record. Now, rotate the setup 90 degrees and take another measurement. Both measurements should be close to one. To view the positioning in real time, open the 3D visualizer, click Start Positioning, and you're ready to go. Thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful in getting your pilot kit up and running. For more information, resources, or support, check out our website at zerokey.com.